Today's video is gonna be about dockers and for the first part because actually I think there will be another one I'll be doing what ECS does with docker images in task definitions namely to launch containers on EC2 instances yeah actually it's one of the methods because there is also Fargate so for this video we'll be doing with EC2 instances as for now let's get started as a first step let's head to our EC2 instance and now we'll be building our docker image to do so we need to write our docker file in which actually we'll define only what we want for our application and then we'll run it after what finally we'll be pushing it into ecr okay okay now let's look for httpd by using the following command okay docker search httpd Let's do it again. As you can see, there are actually many, but we are taking the official one, okay? And this is the one we need. So let's pull it. Okay, good. Okay, now we can share our available images, so let's do it. So as you can see, here it is. Now as another step, we can inspect our image to get more information. Okay, so let's do it. As you can see, there are many information, and in our case, we'll be needing the version and it's actually this one and also the exposed port 980 mm, there's also the working directory this one so so as for now we can start with our docker file but but before that we have to create our source uh, directory where we can put our html files and by the way, you can find all this information in the, in the official website of Docker. So let's head to it. Let's check out the below content. As you can see here, it gives uh, some instructions on how you, you should create your Docker file and so on. Okay, so we can start with naming our source directory by uh, this name. Okay. I copied it and I have to create a folder with that name. I'm going to do that. As for its content, I'm going to create my index file. Okay. And I'm going to copy the following code. Okay, now we have to define our Docker file, okay? Actually, I'm going to get back to our official website of Docker and copy some lines, okay? So I'm going to copy this, paste it here, and I'm going to do the same thing with this line, okay? As for the version, I do prefer to take it from our inspect information I mean results okay and here it is okay now let's add the expose instruction okay and save the file As for now, we can build our image, so we can run it. So let's do it. Let's call it my video app. Okay, good. Now we can run it and check the results. Okay, so let's also do it.
you check the result in our browser. You have to copy this and paste it here. As you can see, it works. And we can see the logs here. This one, for example. So, okay, now we have to create a repository in our ECR service. Okay, so, so let's perform this task. It's actually with IWS common, so it will be IWS ECR create repository. I have to give it a name, so let's let's call it um, my video app. Okay. Actually, I have to specify the path for my comment. Okay, so let's redo it. Okay, good. We can now go to our SR service. Let's check out the new repository. So <coughs> the new one is here. If we also check the push comments, we'll find this. Okay, now let's begin with the first step. We have to copy this and paste it here. I shouldn't forget the path for our comment, so it will be user local bin okay the login succeeded okay as the second step is actually done already done okay as the third step we have to type our image so let's do this okay and finally we have to push our image to our new repository okay Okay, it's done. We can now check the results in our ECR service. <coughs> Let's refresh. Okay, we got it. For instance, you can see ECR as your Docker hub. 